Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome to The Wailing of the Forest, which is a horror game where you meet a lonely, ghostly woman who asks you if you can be her child. Costa Rica, 1826. Boy, 1826 was pretty, uh... Black and white and... Kind of, uh, white noisy. Still I hear her, wailing during quiet nights. Hey. Hey, you! What are you doing here on your own, kid? You lost or something. I'm heading home. You live across the river. That's some bad luck. There was a landslide. The main path is blocked. Is it now? Listen, I need to go take care of some stuff. That won't be long. Wait for me. Set my house and dry yourself up. When I get back, I can show you an alternate path. Okay. Good kid. I'll be going then. Just don't cross the bridge, got it? It ain't safe. So I'm assuming crossing the bridge kind of kicks in the game, right? So we'll just wait here. Don't stare for too long. Don't get too close. Don't turn your back to her. Slenderman? Oh, thing dropped. But I'm gonna wait, because I'm a good kid. Or not. It started here, it must end here. Oh! Okay. <laughs> Death is what I seek. I'm not... That, I don't think that was an ending. I think we just, uh... Went for a nice swim. I'm busy. <laughs> Kids these days. I'll be going then. Just don't cross the bridge, God. It ain't safe. Interesting how you can, like, just be rude and skip the dialogue. Open. What's this? They say she's tortured by regret. They say she drowned her offspring. Even now she weeps for her lost child. Hey, are you okay? I'm not. Um, where is my child? Forever where? I don't know. I don't know. You look just like him. Come to me, my child. Stay back. Or not. You're not really moving. Whoa. Whoa, you move only when I move. And you're gaining speed. You're getting a lot of speed. You're very tall. Wait, I thought you were going to supposed to drown the kid. Death is not the end. Light a candle for the dear explorer, one candle for each murder. Say the newborn was unwanted. 
Interesting. So the game isn't fully static. It started here, it must end here. Hmm. I feel like it's a hint of something. Hey. I remember you. I'm not... Let's try this one. Love choice. Are you my child? I'm not. Where is my child? Further away. Are you... Sure? Yes. All right. I trust you. Well, it's pretty simple. It's not here. Oh, no. Run, 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 run. Death is not the end. Second cow for their patience. Some say her curse is divine punishment. Oh no! Face the rain or face the soil. Retrace your steps, lest you leave this mortal coil. You okay? He's dead. Don't stare for too long, don't get too close, don't turn your back to her. It has to end here, right? Trap forever. I'm back. I'm not your child. Where is my child? Further away? Are you sure? No. That's not technically a lie. Don't lie to me. I'm sorry. Now come to me. Please no. I'm, I, I made it. I made it. Death is not the end. Three candles. A third candle for their temperance. I would say it's a sign of the end times. Face the rain or face the soil. Retrace your steps lest you leave this moral coil. Do these change at all? Alone and forgotten. Lord has forsaken this place. I just kind of like leave now. Get more to it than that. My child, I'm not your child. Can you be my child? Yes! Yes. Thank you. I'll do this as many times as necessary. Wait. No, not, not that part. Not that part.
Death is not the end. Fourth kennel for their tenacity. We were the illusions from the forest leprechauns. Thanks. Here we go again. We go on on dying again. The star here must end here, but we never get to here. Also, this is blocked off now. Oh, look, you're alive. Ish. At dawn, I work the field. At noon, I tend to the cattle. At dusk, I harvest the crops. At midnight, I prepare to do it all over again. At dawn, I work the field. At noon, I tend to the cattle. At dusk, I harvest the crops. At midnight. Hello? Midnight. This isn't good. Then again, has anything been? Not even death is an escape. She's not here. Don't give in. Whoa! Why insist rejecting me? I want to go home. The forest can be your new home. But my family... Forget them. They will only betray you. I love them. I thought I loved my kin too. I smile. But they erased me. Without mercy. You could have stayed by my side. And then we'd be finally happy, happy, my child. But I'm not your child. <coughs> this is your last chance. Come to me, child. Okay. Yes. Together forever and three ends remain. The three they cursed. She's back here crying again. No, she's just outright standing here. Why do you reject me? I'm not your child. Can you be my child? No. I beg of you. Come to me, my child. Stay back! No. No. You too. You're for suff suffocation. Why escape it? Uh oh. That is not the end. I found a one to last all eternity. Feels like I've been here before. Deja vu. Well, the door is it's outright closed now. Start here, it ended, it must end here. And this curse and sir, you. Please, I'm not your child. Can you be my child? No. Make of you? I 
Don't give in. I'm scared. What? You are just kidding. Uh, you. Deaf. Why? Why fear me? All I want is to love you. You hurt me. I did. I had to. I didn't want to. I only want to be loved and be loved, but they let me go. You could have stayed by my side. And then we'd finally be happy. My child. I'm not your child. This is your last chance. Come to me, child. Don't give in. Come to me, please. Nope. It ain't happening. It ain't happening. So you've made it. Your choice. You hurt me, child. Return to where it all began. Run for your life! I just wanted your company. So lonely. After that I ran. I ran until I couldn't stand the pain of my feet and chest anymore. I couldn't bear the thought of facing her again. So I moved with my sight facing the ground, trying my best not to trip and fall. Before I knew it, I was deep in the forest, hopelessly lost. I was all on my own, stuck by those damn forest leprechauns. And a far more dangerous creature. What creature? When you're older, I'll tell you all about. Besides, it's getting late. Just remember not to wander alone in the forest. There are far worse things than apparitions out there. And two ends remain. Meaning for the survivor. Ah, oh, you stay here like I told you. Good kid. So your parents taught you well. But well, you're tall or I'm just small. Come now. Let's get you back home. End two. Ending two. The good kid. Kind of reset all my endings though, when I did that. While well, you're doing that. Get a little bit of a lead. Oh no. That just pisses her off. Can we leave it right now? Wait. Right now. Wait, I've never seen this before. Ah, oh, discover new things every time. No. Come on. Come on. Come on. You're not my child? No. Are you sure? Yes. I'm not. Will you leave me too? Yes.
I miss my child. Hmm. To this day, I vividly remember the, the wailing of the forest. Some say you can still hear it on the dead of night, but I'm positive that when I heard it, it was a rainy day. But that means I couldn't say. As for the accursed app apparition seeking a drowned child, I never saw it again. But I long for the day when I finally forget her wretched face. Alas, my prayers remain unheard, and the sleepless nights continue. Maybe it's the true curse of La Rirona. And one, two ends remain. Ending one, the runaway. So, that's it for the Wailing of the Forest. Pretty good, actually. It kind of made me think of, um, first-generation indie horror games. And I don't mean, like, Slenderman and that stuff, but, like, there was, like, a certain era of, uh, there was one that involved, like, giving a, a ghost girl a heart, for example. But there was, like, a, a series of, like, somewhat creative, simple, but spooky horror games. And then Slenderman kind of took over and, like, became the dominant structure that a lot of games followed for a while. But it had a pretty spooky-looking mom ghost. And it had a gimmick to it. With the, uh, the looping death is not the end mechanic, the change of the dialogue, you notice that there were some events that appeared in my second run, at least one of them anyway. So the game is not linear as far as what you may or may not encounter. And it has an overall, it has an overall kind of smooth feel. It's the best way I can describe it. It plays well for what it is, which helps it stand out a little bit, um, in this type of specific kind of indie horror game. Anyway, so thank you all for watching play The Wailing of the Forest. I'll see you guys later and take it easy.